What is up guys, this is Morton Power 35 here. Welcome back to the channel and today what I have for you guys is a video um, from the Infinite Warfare beta and uh, I just wanted to talk to you guys about something I didn't like. Um, I did a video yesterday talking about how uh, my first impressions of the game, the things I liked, the things I disliked, and it was pretty even. And I gave the game a 7 out of 10 and then I'll go on today and I get a rare variant of a gun which I thought was going to be really good and a supply drop. I put it on, used it in this gameplay, um, it's the rare variant of the Banshee shotgun and started to use it and it is absolute garbage. I don't like it. Um, I know there's probably other YouTubers that will be better at it using it than I am but in my experience with this gun, it is not good. It's a hit marker machine. Um, you can be within two to three feet of an enemy and still not get a shot or still get a shot into them and get a hit marker. Um, in the chest, I was getting hit markers with guys. Um, pretty much you have to be within, within speaking distance or hugging the enemy to actually kill them or get a headshot from certain distances. And I thought being a rare variant that it would have um, higher statistical, you know, ranges and stuff like that. And I was wrong. I'm going to have to go back and do my research on it. But um, I just, I don't like it. Um, it's really bad. And I'm going to switch to the, the K-Bar here in this video. And it's, I go from being really, really bad with the Banshee to going on a really nice gun streak with the with the K-Bar, um, which I'll do a best class setup video on, um, soon. I want to do it before the full game comes out, uh, but I'll probably do it over the weekend when the Xbox One and PlayStation 4 beta releases for the game, but, um, I get all of my streaks with the K-Bar, you know, and in this map, there's really tight corners, so theoretically, you would think that a shotgun would be really, really good, especially in those tight corners, but it's just, it's not, um, I would compare if I could compare this shotgun to another gun from another Call of Duty game I would I would compare it to the Locust from Black Ops 3 because both of them are hit marker machines um, and I feel like I could you know shoot the Locust better than the Banshee in this game um, just to be completely honest but um, I, I still have some things I want to test out um, if and I know this is the beta so it may change the full game I hope it does because I really like using shotguns um, but this is just one that I won't use unless it's changed in the full game but we have to see that when it um when the full game comes out but I just wanted to express my opinion with you guys and that's gonna be it for this video if you if you enjoyed my opinion on this gun um, smash that like button if you enjoyed this game this gameplay smash that like button um and if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, guys. I would really appreciate it. And as always, I'll see you guys on the next video.